Good morning, everybody. Welcome to another vlog. Last full day here in Split, Croatia. Got to sleep in a little bit. Actually heading over to grab some breakfast and this will be the first day in a few days, like two or three days, where I'm gonna be actually social because I'm heading over to meet up with an old classmate from university. Haven't seen her in like eight, nine years, but I noticed that she was in Split, Croatia, so we're gonna go meet up for breakfast. And then later today, we are gonna be, let me back up, you can hardly hear me. Later today, we're gonna be meeting with my friend Lisa from back home in Seattle. She is also in Split, and she's gonna be staying in the Airbnb for one night as well. So a little bit of a exciting day just to like see people familiar. If you're new to my channel, my name is Jerome. I'm a travel vlogger currently here in Split, Croatia doing a three week travel vlog series called Rome Around the World where I take you around the world because my name is Jerome. Yeah, I already been to London and then two days in Bologna, one week in Uri Patanzone, Italy, and then now in Croatia and then after tomorrow heading back to London for four more days. Thumbs up this video if you enjoyed and subscribe to some more travel vlogs and I'll see you guys at breakfast. So I'm here with my friend Amy. How long has it been since we've hung out? Or 10 years. 10 years from college? At least. Oh, there's no more coffee. We might have to get some more. But uh, it was good to see you. I know. <laughs> So after breakfast, I'm here with Amy. We were here at this like juice bar. Thought to get some juice. Had so much fun with Amy. I'm just enjoying my juice. It's a pineapple mango orange juice. Um, it's like a pressed juice. Along the Riva promenade so gorgeous here actually you can see the uh, was here earlier that I arrived on like a few days ago but literally so comfortable so relaxing just being near the waterfront and just chilling kept today free because Lisa wanted to do a whole bunch of stuff when she gets here might do laundry after finishing this I stumbled upon a outdoor market Looks like they have some fruit on this side, some flowers, can you see the flowers? On this side, produce, and then there was like souvenir stuff back there, but I might be looking for a magnet, because I always get a magnet from my aunt back home because she collects them, and maybe a belt. Oh my gosh, the fruit here looks so good. I ended up getting a blueberry and a raspberry. They're 20 kuna each, so 40 all together. Probably about seven? Mix. Oh, they have a mixed one too. Yes. Very the nice. Euro one packet, Croatia, very, very good. Very good, thank you so much. No problem. You guys, I've been boring the past three or four hours because I have just been in the Airbnb. Um, one, editing my vlog that's actually uploading from Ilo Ilo. And then two, having the hardest time figuring out how to work this washer slash dryer. I've already did two cycles on it and I thought I was doing it correctly because there's this little function here that says like, wash and dry for 59 minutes. And I think it might be, so when they ended, it actually didn't give dry clothes it had um, it was still damp and then I couldn't figure out what all of these icons meant and so it got to the point where I was just like went online and then I found out it was this one but it's so weird I mean it's hot anyways um, my friend Lisa is getting here in about 25 minutes she just landed from the airport her 
flight from Vienna was delayed two hours and that's why it's it's almost approaching five o'clock right now it might be five o'clock right now so I'm not sure if we're gonna go swimming but we're gonna get into some stuff show around I don't know how long actually she's here for but she is staying in the Airbnb oh, I'm like I'm like trying to close this window Airbnb for the night and I think she might be going to Italy after that we'll see well, car behind us. Hey guys, so I'm here with Lisa. Hey she guys. arrived. Are you excited? Yes. So we're heading so over excited. to the beach right now. Um, forgot the name of this. Do you remember the name of this beach? It starts with a B. Bob, Bob Jick. Bob Jick. Lisa just happened to be here around the same time, so we decided to meet up. She's staying in the Airbnb. Oh my gosh, look at this, look at this, look at this. <laughs> look at this, guys. There's so many people on this beach. Can you swim? You want to swim to that floaty? Let's do it. Are you excited? You can swim, right? I can swim. Okay, so switching over to the waterproof camera, we're gonna try to go to like the little floaty thing over there. But yeah, see you guys later. Okay, so. After uh, swimming in the, the beach, Lisa and I found our way back to kind of the central split Riva area. We're gonna go grab some gelato because I've been talking about that place called getting, Luca. Wait, let's say we're getting gelato before our dinner and after. And after, just to <laughs> test out multiple places. But we're going back to that Luca place for gelato. Back at our favorite place, Luca. Uh, they have all of these flavors. I think I might get the banana stracciatella or the kexi cookie looks good. Man. Ended up getting the banana stracciatella cake uh, cone. What did you get? The split cake. Yum! Fala Libra. Fala Libra. Thank you so much. Oh. Fala. Oh, dang. Uh, so we had ice cream for pre-dinner, but we have a pre-pre-dinner to our pre-dinner, <laughs> which is uh, burek, which is, um, they have it with either like vegetables or cheese or meat, but this one is the, awesome. looks good. Yes. Aren't you jealous? Yum, so we're gonna eat it. How do you say the name of this place? Konoba. Konoba is a type of restaurant. Luchas. Luchas. Okay, we're gonna go to this place. Hey! Called Konoba Luchas. Um, since 1982, it was also recommended by your Uber driver. Uber driver. And we trust him. So He taught us some words too. He taught us some words and we're Fala Lipa. Fa Fala Lipa. Fala Lipa. Thanks a lot. Thanks a lot. Hopefully it's not too busy. All the other restaurants in like the Riva area were packed because of the World Cup semifinal between France and Belgium. Um, but it doesn't look like it's that busy here, so. And it's right by the Airbnb. It's so super cool. close. So if they say, you look ratchet that's with true, your- but we have to walk further to get um, gelato again. It's a shot. It's a shot. Yeah. Who cares? <laughs> we're in Croatia. We're in Croatia. Okay, we gotta- okay. Say, what do you say when you do cheers? How do you say cheers? Jibili. 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 Okay. Yes. Jibili. 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 Free shots. Oh, that was good. Slightly sweet. Yes, <laughs> okay. Just got back from dinner. Dinner was really good. I think I'm gonna end the vlog for today. Thank you so much for watching. Today's last full day in Split Croatia. Tomorrow, um, I leave at 5 p.m. from Split back to London. Um, but in the morning, uh, Lisa and I are gonna be doing a kind of kayak trip morning expedition type of thing where we're gonna be going on kayaks, 
Um, I think we're doing snorkeling and a whole bunch of fun stuff in the water uh, in the morning. So we're going to be doing that and then killing some time before my flight later in the afternoon back to the UK. So don't forget to thumbs up this video if you enjoyed. Subscribe to see more travel vlogs and I will see you guys tomorrow. Bye!